in the new year, we have these very lofty goals that we want to maintain, and then by January 2nd, it's like, <laughs> we forget about it. So I talk about aiming true, and that's that ability to set intention, but more important than aiming true is this ability to, to stay true. Anyone can set intention, but the real mountain to climb is can you maintain it? So what I recommend to people is find these digestible bites. Like don't set an intention that is so completely far-fetched than where you are at this moment in time, because then it's almost like setting yourself up for failure. And I also don't believe in marking your calendar when it comes to goals, because what if you've done your best completely? What if you've put 100% of yourself into the situation and that date arrives and you haven't achieved that goal yet? That doesn't mean you're a failure because you've done your best. It just means it's not time right. So we have to believe that when we set our intention, we're aiming true, we're staying true, that it will arrive, you will hit your mark when the time is right, and just let it go. It's this ability to move into a place of acceptance and just show up every day and be like, this is me, hear me roar, and then hear me snore, <laughs> go back to sleep, and I'll do it again tomorrow. My personal mantra in life is aim true, and it's derivative from the Greek goddess Artemis, the goddess of the moon, the goddess of the hunt. She represents a strong woman who's unafraid to live the life that she finds fit. So I'm, I'm so excited. My new book is called Aim True, and I'll be releasing it at the end of March, and it's like scooping a little piece of my heart out and, and offering it to the world, and I, I hope that it's digestible and, and useful for everyone who reads it. My advice for yoga beginners is you'll only be a beginner once, so enjoy it. Like, don't be in a rush to do the handstand in the middle of the room. Enjoy falling on your face. Enjoy the floor burns. You will get good someday, and then next thing you know, everything will be easy. And I think what keeps us showing up in any format is a challenge. So don't look at a challenge as a negative thing. It's a constant push to expand. Always be a student, always be a sponge, always be open.